okay guys so i'm having this other problem for statistics so this one is for grouped data you you have data that is group is grouped the intelligence um question score that iq of a grade 10 class is summarized in the table below so iq level that is night between 90 and, and and 100 there are four learners that are found to fall within this interval and there are eight learners that are found to fall in this interval so now we're gonna be asking we're gonna be answering questions based on this kind of problems right so they are saying what write down the modal class these are classes the intervals write down the modal class remember a mode is a number that is mostly repeated so if they say a modal class you check on your frequency here and the mode lies in a in a, in an interval with the highest frequency so the highest frequency in this case is this one that's the highest frequency so so the modal class will be 100 because that is the highest frequency so the modal class always lies in an interval which has the highest frequency so they say determine the interval in which the median lies remember these things have been arranged from small to big right so these are four learners in this interval then four plus eight is twelve so if we add all of these the frequencies it will tell us how many learners uh, formed part in this so four plus eight plus seven plus five plus four plus two plus four plus two right so we found that is 30 learners so the median must be the 15th and the 16th added together okay so we want to know when in which interval will the 15th learner be so in the first interval we have four learners so we go to the second interval we add with eight learners so four plus eight that's 12. then we come here so 12 plus 7 that's 19 so basically the middle learners they will lie in this interval so it's gonna be 110 and 120 okay so yeah that's how you answer that question so and this this other interesting question they say estimate the mean you know estimate the mean so in estimating the mean guys you will need to do this this guy here you need to do this and maybe one last column it a bit and they say now here we're gonna find the midpoint of the interval this x here so how do we find this midpoint you say 90 plus you just add these two numbers here 90 plus 100 divided by 2 it gives you the midpoint so that's 95 then you say 100 plus 110 100 plus 110 divided by 2 so i get 105 then you say 110 plus 120 divided by 2 so that's 115 then you say 120 plus 130 divided by 2 that's 125 then you say 130 plus 140 divided by 2 that's 135 140 plus 150 divided by 2 that's 145 so we found the midpoint right there and then we're gonna take that midpoint we multiply it with frequency so this is gonna be this column so you're just gonna say midpoint multiplied by frequency so here you're gonna say 4 
times 95. 4 times 95 is going to be 380. And you say 8, 8 times 105 is going to be 840. 7 times 115 is going to be 805. Then 5 times 125, 625. 4 times 135 is going to be 540. 2 times 145 is going to be 290. So basically what we do is you, you take the middle of this, then you multiply with the frequency. Then you, 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 you're going to add all of these guys here to calculate the mean now. You're going to say 8380. Eight, eight, plus 840 plus 805 plus 6625 plus 540 plus 290 divided by the number of people involved we just found that it's 30 because when we add all the frequencies we get 30 so now we're gonna check if we add all of these guys together 380 plus 840 plus 805 plus 625 plus 540 plus 290 so that's that's 3480 divided by 20 so this is the estimated so let's just do those equal signs that shows its estimation divided by 30 not 20 this is 30 divided by 30 is 116 so family that is the estimated mean thank you so much